Hi everyone, this is Fred from 4x4 shop. Today we want to install our 10.25 inch Android screen in a 6 series. It's a 2015 BMW 6 series, fully loaded. And we want to install our iNav screen. So that's how the packing looks like inside the box. You get a screen. It's 10.25 inch screen. It comes with the cover that it replaced the uh, factory cover at the back of the screen. And that's how the screen looks like. You get one main T harness that it goes at the back of the head unit. 4G antenna. You can add the GPS antenna splitter to use the factory antenna. Share the factory GPS antenna between our unit and the screen. And two USBs that they come uh, in the box. Usually we sell the uh, USB extensions to a lot of customers. They ask what is the USB extension. So as you can see, our unit comes with two USBs. And these USBs from the back of the screen uh, they're long enough to go inside the glove box, but if you want to run them somewhere else, let's say in the armrest, then they're not that long, so you need extensions. And uh, you can buy our USB extensions to run them wherever you desire, like even in the armrest. And there is one auxiliary input for some MBT units, you don't need to use the auxiliary input, for some, you do. But uh, we're gonna try and test to see if we need it for this MBT or not. So we get back to you with the results. Okay, so right now the unit is installed. You can see how it looks like all around. It looks like factory fit and it gives a nice look without the uh, silver trim around the screen. It gives like a newer look to this BMW. So by going to reverse, the uh, cameras, they start to work. By going to park, it goes back to the factory screen. Uh, this is the Apple CarPlay. I can use the iDrive knob or I can use the touch screen either or is perfectly fine so at the beginning of the video I was talking about if MBT for 6 series needs to connect to the aux the answer is you don't need to connect it to the aux uh, there is not much light here but uh, yeah if there is no need to connect auxiliary uh, to the actual auxiliary input of the car and it switches automatically in one of the cases This is one of those cases. Maybe in some cases you need to uh, Connect the auxiliary and you have to do it manually, but for this 6 series uh, We don't need to do so. So that's how the unit is and We have a lot of videos regarding how the unit works, but uh, Again, I go fast through it so you can see how the unit works and the dashboard is one of our best functions especially the red one for this sport car look beautiful and I go to car info it goes back to the factory iDrive system for the car and it retains all the functions including navigation and the split screen so everything works perfectly fine and again from our screen you can play video even in motion we don't recommend it but yeah that's a feature that you can do and this is 1920 resolution screen you can see how clear and nice is this screen 
If you're interested to get these type of screens, you can buy them online from 4x4shop.ca or you can give us a call at 905-604-4294 and one of our technicians will be more than happy to assist you. Uh, yeah, we always here to help you. Just give us a call. Thank you.